All right, guys. So now I'm in Nanchang. Nanchang is the capital of Jiangxi Province. I'm going to stay here for just like two two days more, two days and a half. This bit of tired. I have been driven on the road for four hours. This kind of trip from city to from one city to another takes a lot of energy. And uh, first, uh, take a look at this uh, hotel. Oh. Change, change the angle of the, the camera. Yeah, so this is a really massive room. I didn't expect this much. So a little sofa. This is uh, the facility, you know, sofa lamp, background light, and they have the English version, which is good, and two USB plug-in, and one, uh, I don't usually use this, like three, uh, how to call it, I don't know, anyway. So yeah, here you got a desk. This is like a modern de uh, <coughs> renovation. And uh, what is this one? It's a it's an air cleaner or something. And uh, you got some UPS power, which is good. And oh, you, you got a lamp here. Anyway, uh, an embedded uh, embedded TV, which is not that big actually. And something for drink free drinkings to bottle of water a water boiler yeah Let, let's check out what ah i don't have a mini bar which is a pity but it's fine china is quite convenient you can just get down and grab whatever you want and take it back so yeah anyway so i think this is uh, something different in China, you always have this, uh, you know, toothbrush. There's a little toothpaste inside, and this one, uh, a, a comb, right? And uh, yeah, the, something like the the cap for a shower cap. My wife loves it. So hot water and the cold water is sanitized or whatever. So China come back here, and here you can you know just hand up your clothes, everything. So this is that you always see in China, this uh, kind of like uh, you know sign everywhere. So no drugs, no drug dealer, no gambling, uh, no prostitution. You know you can report it by call one one zero which is the 911 here in China. This is the shower room. It's a little bit tiny, but it's fine because it's functional, you know. The toilet and uh, here you got a shower room. This is, uh, I talked before, in China, they give you these uh, slippers for free. Uh, I don't think in the Nordic countries, in the hotel, they will give this kind of uh, slippers. Nantong city is as different as the uh, the other two cities, uh, Changsha and uh, what's that? Changsha and Wuhan. This one uh, it looks like a little bit old or something. Not old, but you know, the layout or the feeling. You don't see like a you know high lifted uh, metro way you know across the city or something like that. But anyway, we are going to Shenjing Park. So the place is called Shenjing Park. Sounds like a pagoda, you know, and a historical walking pedestrian, as well as the food market. So instead of using the scooter, uh, this time for tonight, I'm going to just uh, take the metro and go there. Actually, it's just one stop. Uh, we can also walk to there, but you know. Uh, as I promised before, every city, each city of China, I'm gonna show you how the metro system not look, look like. Uh, some cities got more uh, lines, some cities are not. I think Nanchang city got only like uh, six lines or something. It's really depending on the population and it's depending on the scale of the city. So, by the way, I'm feeling like a 
better now because uh, after six or seven days uh, out of out out and uh, you know it's, uh, walking and traveling, I'm kind of like tired. And this is uh, some kind of like Dongfang Taohua residential. It's a high building. Not good. Not good looking. But uh, I mean, comparing to to these buildings, I think the high buildings are perhaps better. <laughs> anyway. <coughs> So the same thing, uh, I'm going to use uh, the virtual metro card in Alipay instead of uh, buy a physical ticket in the vending machine. It's just the same, the other cities in China, uh, coin, coins, or you can scan the QR code to buy tickets. So there are only, sorry, I was wrong. There are only four lines in, in the Nanchang city. And I think you can switch it to English version, it doesn't matter. So yeah, uh, not very difficult to use. Anyway, let's go into the metro station. The so-called Shenjing business district seems like not that busy, huh? Maybe. Oh my God! This these shops are closed. Looks like Changsha, right? The majority of the shops. Have uh, we already reopened or restored? But not in Anchang. Basically, a theme park and the food street. But not ma that much of the customers. This shopping center, just uh, on the other side of the road, uh, serving to the scenic spot, serving to this Shenjing uh, Tang. Well, well, you will see it shortly. So, this is Shenjing Tang. It's a nice pagoda. Well, from outfit, it doesn't look like a historical ar architecture. Uh, I think they restore it or repaint it. This uh, second architecture to check out in the capital of Jiangxi province, Nantong City. This is the uh, Shenjing Ta. Uh, this is the, the front square of the Shenjing Ta and. Uh, the, the, the massive uh, stage behind me, I think it's for the, the opera <coughs> and uh, a nice pagoda. Uh, although we have seen a lot of uh, similar architectures, but this one, yeah, it's the so-so.
I didn't expect this uh, main temple uh, behind the pagoda. This one is nice actually, and it is massive, massive. I think they restored it. It's uh, 7 15. Now you have some kind of like vibe. You know, people are gathering together in the evening, but uh, it's cooler. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know. That's a big shock. It's everywhere. The business district is uh, lights on. Yeah, sort of, you know. You see the commercial street vibes, but not totally as the same as Changsha, right? Hope the, the GoPro can perform okay in the you know, dark area. Oh, still, many shops are not opening, even though those lights are sort of turned on. Not all the lights, the same as before, I think before the pandemic. The, the shops along the street, like these shops, are not opening. Okay, I'll shut my mouth up and uh, you guys just uh, take a street view of uh, this Shenjin Ta Koto and uh, you know, who the district. Then we move on to the next stop.